קצר במרכז ירושלים. I grew up in the heart of Hamas leadership. My father, Sheikh Hassan Youssef, is one of the founding members of Hamas organization. There are some turning points, important events that happen in my life. Uh, one of the most important ones uh, is what happened in prison, uh, witnessing Hamas torturing uh, our own people. And for the first time, I came face to face with the real nature of Hamas organization which, you know, they don't care for the lives of Palestinians. They don't care for the lives of uh, anybody. And now the truth starts to uh, uh, be revealed gradually. And I saw completely a different uh, uh, reality, which, you know, eventually led me to uh, at least do what I could to stop killing. At some point of my life, I had to trade identity, family, culture, traditions, religion, gods, everything for the sake of humanity. For 10 years, Mossab worked undercover for Israel. Israel's internal security service, the Shin Bet, considered him its most valuable source within the Hamas leadership. For the Shin Bet, it was like, you know, a real achievement in the war against Hamas. It's like recruiting the son of the Israeli prime minister. We called him the Green Prince. He managed to give the most uh, known names today as of the wanted terrorists to the Shin Bet to pass some kind of uh, information about those terrorists to prevent, on his own almost, to prevent uh, more than tens and tens and tens of suicide attacks and actually to save the life of hundreds of uh, of Israelis. We were not only saving Israeli lives, also Arab lives, American lives. Saving a human life is uh, is a precious thing. He saved many, many lives. He did incredible things. I was able to stop a suicide bomber. Someone going uh, among uh, civilians that he doesn't know, killing himself and killing others. And we need a new leadership. We need a new generation who believe that uh, there is a chance uh, to live uh, side by side uh, with Israel. Israel is not the problem in the Middle East. Israel is the solution to the Middle East. Hopefully I will see reconciliation you know, between uh, uh, many people who think that they are separated, but they are not. They are the same.